So what I'm going to do next is concealer. And this concealer I have not tried yet. Well, I actually, I can't remember if I tried it or if I just swatched it. This is the Match Perfection Skin Tone Adapting Concealer. And this is by Rimmel. And that's what that looks like. It's got a little brush on the end, which I am not crazy about those, but we will see. Get my... Okay... I'll come on here. Okay, I am going to, first of all, I'm going to try to do this with my fingertips. Might have put a little bit too much on. Let's go in with a beauty blender. That actually went in pretty good. Put a little bit, not quite as much on this eye. There we go, that should be good enough. So I'm hoping things are starting to look up for me. It'll still be at least two weeks before I would get an unemployment check, which that's, that's what's going to hurt these next two weeks. Um, waiting for a check. Um, especially when she expects things. Um, my landlord expects money on Friday. All right, there we go. That doesn't look too bad. All right, I'm going to go in with do my brows. And this one's a new one also. This one is the Rimmel uh, Brow This Way. And I have it in, holy cow, medium brown. There's what it says there. All right. This is quite a pretty big wand here. But it's definitely doing the job. I need a new spoolie um, mine is starting to wear down quite a bit. Uh oh. There's my spoolie. Uh oh. Shoot. What the heck happened to my spoolie? That is crazy. That is crazy. Let's do this. Ugh. This is not working. My spoolie is not where I always put it. 
That is just nuts to me. And I can't imagine that I would have put it. You guys, look at my eye brushes. <laughs> It's got to be here somewhere. Well, that is just crazy. And about to pee me off. Well, this will have to work. Be about that. My own fault. I don't know where I put it. Unless it fell on the floor behind my desk here. Get down on my hands and knees and look, I guess. And I um, was in a pretty bad accident when I was like 18 years old. Oh my God, I'm totally screwing this one up. And um, have a pretty bad scar up here. And so um, part of my eyebrow does not grow in. So it looks pretty bad compared to the other one. And I just, I suck at drawing in my eyebrows. at all. My spoolie helps so much when I'm doing my eyebrows and this was a rather a big <sighs> a big um, spoolie on this. So anyway let's do on to the eyelash or I'm going to use my Naked 3 which I received um, from my good friend on Facebook that I'm not going to name names. She had sent me this a while ago. Okay, let's see here. Um, I should have been ready with this stuff. Cheapers, creepers. Okay, let's just use this. Um, let's see. Let's start with this color. Do this all over the lid. Once I'm done here, I'll show you which colors I used. So put that at the corner here. Whoops. And up more under that. Okay, so now what am I gonna use? Let's see here. My brush off. I don't use 10 million zillion brushes per eye. I just clean my brush in between. Um, let's go with Blaze. Kind of a pinky. And I don't do a ton more with my eyes than what I'm doing right now because I'm terrible at doing the outer V. It never, my eyes are so hooded.
just gonna put another coat of that on. Okay. And anybody that knows me knows I like gold in the center. Okay. Clean that off. Then I'm going to go in with this really dark just going to try it here I may not even oops may not even use eyeliner By the way, I practiced a wing eyeliner earlier, never done one before, and it was an epic fail. <laughs> I need to um, get a different eyeliner, a good eyeliner. So I need some. Most of mine are um, pencil type. That actually looked pretty good. <sighs> okay, so I'll show you what I used. Used this all over my brow. This is color strange. And then I used... <laughs> I thought that said something else. I used Blaze on my lid. Then I used Trick for my gold. I thought it said Prick, actually. <laughs> and on my... Um, Blackheart is the one I used underneath. All right. So that for that. Um, I am going to try just, I'm going to do a little bit of water, or water line with my Urban Decay. I just sharpened this actually, so. line here. Oh, that hurts. I don't like doing that. You can see it defines that eye just a little bit when you do that. This was the Urban Decay 24-7 Velvet in Black Velvet that I used. Okay. Now I'm going to use my new Super Sizer. Um, although I did not get this in waterproof, um, I couldn't find it in waterproof. So I, I'm hoping this does a good job. And this is what the... I mean, so many people on on um, YouTube are really hyping up this stuff, so that I had to try it. Got this in my Christmas box from Alta, from my mom and my son, or my son's family, I should say. Actually, it was just from my mom and my son, and the the photo was from the family. clumps a little clump kind of clumps them together just a little bit um, but it's really not bad I don't mind it at all ouch god dang it right on my lid
Really, I don't think it makes my lids look bad at all. Or my lashes, I should say. Damn it. Wow. Let that dry and I'll go in for one more coat. Let's do the bottom lashes here. These, um, this wand is so different and it, I kind of like it. I usually like the big old fluffy lids, wands, but I kind of like this one. I have a harder time doing my left eye than I do my right, just because I'm using my right hand. are done. Okay, for the cheeks, I decided to go in with my Milani Romantic Rose Powder Blush. That's what it looks like. Absolutely beautiful. And I'm going to use my new, oh, I hate to even get this dirty, <laughs> my new powder brush um, from Real Techniques. All right. like I'm pulling and it looks like I'm pulling a lot of that foundation off oh it's not near as pretty now okay for my highlighter I'm going to use now this here is not new everything else has and this wasn't new but everything else was new so far um I'm going to go in with my hard candy, and it is uh, Tiki, 129 Tiki. Beautiful. Let's see, what brush do I want to use? I'm going to use a small one. Let's see here. Where's my fan brush? There's my fan brush. I'll just use it. All right, one other thing I did not get out was my powder that I want to use. Just one second, I'll just grab one. I just grabbed one, and that's all I did. Um, that is my CoverGirl Ready Set Gorgeous. This was the first one in the pile, so that's what I grabbed. That's what it looks like. And this is actually... Fresh Complexion Powder Foundation, but I use it as an all-over face powder when I want to set my makeup. Oh, and I'm using my, my new um, powder blush by Real Techniques. Okay. All right, for lipstick, I chose to do the, what's this called? The Only One Lipstick by Rimmel. Um, and this is in color 800 under my spell. This is what it looks like. So pretty. Kind of a purplish berry.
not very clean lipstick put her on her. There we go. That looks pretty good. All right, guys. There is my my uh, get ready with me with my physician's formula and my Lumi. If you guys have used this, tell me what you think. If you like this kind of video, please give me a thumbs up. It helps so much. Um, and. I can't think of anything else on my update. I will let you guys know about if I get the interview or whatever. Um, cross your fingers for me. I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye-bye.